Good day, mates. Welcome back to the channel. It is your captain speaking. Welcome back, everybody. Hope you're doing well. Green Mile today. This is probably our last stop on the Tom Hanks train for now. I've banged out about a month's worth of Tom Hanks videos, and you know what? It's been a pretty bloody good month, man. The reception's been crazy. Support's been crazy. Dude, Tom's been doing his thing, man, and I love him. But we've got to give him a little break. There's so many other movies to get to. Speaking of which... I just started a post on my channel. If you go to the community tab, you can do this on computer or on mobile, wherever you want. Open the community tab, scroll down a bit, and you'll see my comprehensive list of movies I'm going to watch in the future. Um, comment whatever other movies you want to recommend me there. I mean, you can still comment under the video, but I'm kind of using this space as like, you know, where I find other recommendations and then add them to my own list. So keep an eye out for that. Um, next thing's up. We are almost at 2,000 subs. That's crazy. We still got just a bit over half the month left. I don't know if you guys remember, but I did say let's try and get to 2024 subs before the end of the year. I think that would be pretty sweet. I feel like it's important to have goals. So let's, we already set that one and let's try and smash it. I think we can do it. Um, and last but not least, for me, I've been thinking for that 2,000 subscribers, a couple of people have been asking me to make like a kind of a Q&A video about myself. Just, you know, explaining who I am, what I'm into, letting you guys ask me whatever questions you want to ask me, and I'll just upload it as a video. That's what I've been thinking for doing the 2,000 subscriber milestone. So if you want to see something like that, just let me know in the comments saying, yep, q and is great. I'd love that. You should definitely do that because if people want to see it, I will make it. Anyway, without any further ado, as per usual with this channel now, we will leave all of our critiques, opinions, thoughts, scoring, everything, analysis at the end of the video after the reaction's done. So if you really care about the movie, stick around for that and uh, I'll let you know my thoughts on it. Without further ado, The Green Mile, Tom Hanks. Tom Hanks' train just keeps on chugging. Choo choo, let's go. What's going on here? The whole town's got their pitchforks. They're on the hunt. It's a beautiful movie. The dimension that I was in charge of death row, that I supervised all the executions. That's heavy. That's a tough gig. That year, I had the worst urinary infection of my life. Sheesh. Hey, it's that bloke from, uh... Saving Private Ryan, the sniper who does all those religious chants and then hits every shot he goes for. What the heck? The man, the myth, the legend. The one, the only. Damn, it's a big boy. Man! Dead man walking! Oh, that's uh, morbid. Just announce him as a dead man walking the second he steps on that yard. Sheesh. Michael Clark Duncan! Yes, I boss. I can tell. Oh my gosh, rest in peace, man. I freaking love Michael. Move your ass. Let's go. Dude, Percy Come is on. a piece of work, that's for sure. Because I get a little scared in the dark sometimes. Who doesn't? It it's scary. Oh wow. Look how big his hand is. Doesn't really seem, he doesn't really seem like you're a typical prisoner, does he? <laughs> What's going on? Jesus. Oh. Boy, you under arrest for murder. Oh. Like it or not, the wife of the governor of this state has only one nephew, and his name happens to be Percy Whitmore. Game's got that privilege. He squeals like a <laughs> schoolroom sissy. <laughs> sissy. Ratatouille. <laughs> you little son <laughs> of a bitch. Oh, this dude's taking this a little personal, isn't he? It's just a rat. You can kiss my ass. Oh, oh crap, it's putting hands on him. Go on, try it. 
you be on the bread lines before the week is out. He isn't wrong, man. You'll get another call from the state capital. This dude, this dude's got bloody connections. You ever threaten a man on this block again, we all gonna have a go. Ooh. Job be damned. That's right, mate. Now you've been put on blast. I want a fried chicken dinner with gravy on the taters, and I want a shit in your hat. I got to have Mae West sit on my face because I'm one horny motherfucker. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this old mate's play rough around the edges. What a what a demand. I'm fine. I'm fine. Who played too much, man? Oh my god, that rat. Dude, is that that rat is like a, a big plot point in this film, I Let's feel do like. It again. Let's get it right this time. Get that idiot out of the chair. I got my eyes on that rat. Something's fishy. Jesus Christ. Adios, chief. Drive us a card from hell. Let's know if it's hot enough. Oh my god, this Percy guy, seriously. Dude, I've never seen or heard of that before about somebody getting electrocuted, but they didn't die the first time, so they had to get re electrocuted. Jesus. Messed up. <laughs> <laughs> He needs something now. <laughs> He's smart, Mr. Jingles. Mr. Jingles. Oh my gosh, he's so clever. <laughs> Mr. Jingles. Oh no, he's somehow happy with life. Why's he crying? William Horton. William Horton. Call. A problem child. Oh no, here comes drama. Billy. It's a tumor, Paul. Oh no. A brain. <laughs> Dude, this urinary infection, man, this looks rough as guts, man. God, I hope I never have that. Oh, oh, God. Jesus Christ. Oh, no. What the hell's... What's going on here? Oh, Jesus. You ruined me! Well, come on! My God. This guy's a bloody loose cannon. Warden is a beast. The dude just took out almost the whole room full of bloody guards. What the heck? We thought he was doped. Didn't we? Didn't we all of us think he was doped? We, we did think that. We did. What do you want, John Coffey? Just to help. What the hell? What is he doing? He's filling him up. What are you doing? Dying for a touch. <laughs> Why is that light going on? There's something strange about John Coffey, man. There is something very strange. Besides, he just grabbed uh, Tom Hanks's wicker whacker. His little Johnson downstairs. <laughs> what? What is that? Is this like a supernatural movie? What the heck? I had no idea. Things have just taken a turn for the strange. I helped it. Didn't I help it? He healed him? He's doing it. He's doing it. That's a full stream. Look at him. Look at him. Somebody's in a good mood. What are the doctors? He's checking her out too. Tom's running on demon time. Dude, the Hank man got something in his eyes. He's feeling, he's feeling ravenous tonight. Yeah, let's do tonight. Yeah, once do you? It was some mouse on his mind. Well, I know what it feels like. Ooh, she likes that too. Great. The neck kisses, man. They just. They never fail. Ever. It's a sure thing. The old reliable as I call it. He in there. He tearing that thing up. You're complaining. Uh -huh. But we haven't gone four times in one night since we were 19. Four times. The Hank man just annihilated her. She ain't gonna be able to walk. Yeah. 
I never actually made it into Dark Bishops yesterday. No, nope. prisoner grabbed my little ding dong and prize. Is that Lieutenant Dan? Got some company. Dude, everybody, everybody's in this movie. What's going on? Oh, was your missus pleased? It was more than pleased. It was ecstatic. Times. Oh, several. Oh, Max, the dog. This for deal, Mr. Jingle. Oh wow. Hey, very that? generous. Jingle, thank you. My mama will thank you too, but she did. Welcome. <laughs> hey! What about me? You don't get any. That on me, you big dummy nigger. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Warden is scum. I hope he gets what's coming to him, man. I hope he gets his just desserts. I do. <laughs> this dude is Good sick. Job, Deranged. <laughs> Look on your One foot. sick puppy, man. <laughs> this guy makes me so incredibly uncomfortable, man. Go man to man. Oh, damn. Piss on me. Piss on him back. <laughs> now you're scared, are you, mate? Hey? You can nickel for that moon pie. What is he doing? Oh my god. <laughs> this dude is just nasty, man. Damn, I hate moon pie thing. It's pretty original, gotta give him that. It, it, it was, I'm not gonna lie. I've never seen that before. I was wondering why he wasn't eating it. No, he was really playing the long con with that one. What if that dude never showed up? He would've been standing there with a bloody moon pie in your mouth for a goddamn decade. Just have... Oh crap. Oh, she's so important. Oh. Soft like a girl. He is soft. Fuck your asshole. Jesus Christ. It's just pussy, I think. Warden! Oh, oh. Just when you think Warden couldn't get any nastier, he goes and does it. <laughs> Pissing himself. He don't piss it back. Somebody touch him, he may water in his pants like a little baby. Yeah, he does. He ain't built for this life, I'm telling you. Percy ain't supposed to be here. You talk about this to anyone, I get you all fired. Sounds like something he would say. Oh my god. Percy! You kill my mom. Percy's such a baby. He pissed himself, got made fun of pissing himself, and took it out on Mr. Bloody Jingles. Oh god, Percy. Dude, Percy, I just know he's gonna get what's coming to him. I just feel it. And it ain't gonna take long. John Coffee? Don't tell me. He's not going to bring the mouse back to life, is he? Is he? The light again. Oh my god, again. Mr. Jingles! He did it! Oh yeah, you're playing with me, huh? Both of you. It's just who the hell you think you are. Huh? Oh shit. Get his ass. There's no such place. That's just a fairy tale these guys told you to. Percy! <laughs> just thought you should know. Faggot. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Unbelievable, man. Unbelievable. What's he doing? He didn't soak the sponge? Electricity shall now be passed through your body until you are dead. This is something else. Why do they law. allow like a room full of spectators for somebody's God execution? God have mercy on is your that, soul. Is that normal? Let me know. Is that common? I don't know. Kind of weird to me. It's not really a spectacle. A man's getting killed. I noticed. Percy, you're gonna pay, mate. You are gonna pay. God, this fail. Is he feeling it? Oh my god. Why is he feeling it? Why? 
He's burning alive! He's on fire! I can't believe Percy just did that. I can't believe Percy just did that. Jesus Christ. I didn't know this bone just supposed to be wet. Do it again. Do it again. He's the lucky one. No matter how it happened, Dale's the lucky one. That's quite a claim, mate, considering what just bloody happened to him. Oh, man. The one's wife is looking... Not good, man. Not well. Not well at all. So you're talking about... Taking John Coffee to her. You're a smuggled joint out of the prison? Jeez Louise. Yeah. In fact... I don't think you did it at all. Yeah, I'm starting to think that as well. I hope I'm not proven wrong, because I'm really starting to like John. God putting a, yeah. a gift like that in the hands of a man to kill a child. Tell us what you have in mind. The boy's coming through, man. The boys are coming through. This is a great gang of uh, guards that we got over here, man. They're so genuine, so nice, so lovely. It's kind of refreshing because in most prison movies, the guards are assholes. It's just just the way they're portrayed usually. So it's kind of refreshing, man. This group, I like them. It's for sure. Caring for mental patients. So it looks like he's going to actually live up to his word for once. And oh my God, he's reading comic or oh, smut comic books. Percy. I was just about to give you a little, a little bit of a credit, just a little bit. It didn't take you long for, for you to make me re regret it. <laughs> Come on, boss. Oh. I've been good. I've been good all day. Cheeky. Homeless man. Or else I'd drink this myself right here in front of you. <laughs> Come on now, don't be that away. I'll be good. Dude, Tom Hanks too slick with it. That played him. Damn, they put too much in. Old mate said that's an overdose. It's a lot of lead pot. Oh, Percy. What would your mother say? You didn't let go of me, you ignoramus. Ignoramus. Dude, that's a throwback. I haven't heard that in a decade. Ignoramus, wow. Like... <laughs> you bad man. The worst. Damn, dude, Operation, get John out of this prison. Now, take it easy now. Don't you move. Wait. John, this is so I'm tense. No, Wait. Hal, listen to me. Hold right there, I shoot. I said, Don't do it, Hal. I'll put it down. Help. He's doing it. The Miracle Man. John Coffee's unstoppable. How does he do it? She looks so much better. Wow. This is incredible. Let me out of his nut coat. In a minute. Now. Right now. I want out now! Oh. oh. What now? What the hell? He's giving him the insects! Ew. Can't say I'm sad to see that. You reap what you sow, mate. We are who we choose to be. Bit of myself. Even a little bit of myself. A gift. The two girls from the start? It was him? Oh my god. No way. I worked here enough for one day. Come get you some supper. Oh my god. Oh, oh. So when John found them, they were already dead. He was trying to bring them back alive. Oh, what a cruel twist of fate. 
He's in the mental hospital now? That's crazy, dude. That's He was supposed to be working at a mental hospital. Now he's a bloody patient in one. I'm telling you, man, everybody who's done wrong, wrong things in this movie, all the wrongdoers, they really are getting what's coming to them. They're getting their just desserts. Briar Ridge, it's literally the exact hospital he was going to work at. Dude, this film is off, off the rails, man. It is out of control. It is crazy. Meatloaf be nice. Mashed taters. Gravy. Ooh. Okra. Mmm. Maybe some of the fine cornbread your missus make. Ah, oh, damn. If she don't mind, see me a flick of show. Flick of show, eh? You in a movie? That's the movie that old Tom Hanks was watching at the start before he started tearing up. Oh my gosh. Everything's coming full circle. Dreamed about Dale's mouth. It's Jingles. Did you, John? I dreamed Mr. Jingles got down to that place Boss Howell talked about. Mansville. Down in Florida. <laughs> kill him twice, you boys. Jesus Christ. You go on kill it. Raping baby killer twice. That'd be fine. He doesn't understand, but I don't blame him. This is not the way it's supposed to end, man. This is not the way it's supposed to end. Sorry for what I am. He's nothing to apologize for. This is so messed up. <laughs> Even all the guards are tearing up. It was the last execution I ever took part in. The last? Police couldn't do it anymore after that. It was brutal either. We... Why are they resigned? Yeah, I took jobs with boys correctional. Makes sense. You said you and Jan had a grown son in 1935. He did say that. Mr. Jingles! How long has he been alive for? Can't be. No way. What? John had to give me a part of himself. So we could see the vision. I could see for myself yes. what Bob had done. Do you have the same thing that Mr. Jingles has? I'm 108 years old, Elaine. 108! Melinda, Brutus Howe, a wife, a boy. Damn. Oh my god, I hate In truth, I wish for it already. Wow. I lie in bed most nights thinking about it. The Green Mile. Frank Darabont. Dude, that was unbelievable, man. Let's head to the outro. Stick around if you want to hear my thoughts. I'll see you there. Alrighty, everybody. The Green Mile. First things first, acting. On point. As per usual with all these movies. I don't know man. Tom Hanks. Kills it. And I feel like the people that work with Tom Hanks. He kind of elevates them a bit more. Does that make sense? I don't think I'm crazy for saying that. I think like when people are working with Tom Hanks. They're like. i got to bring my A game. Like i got to bring my A game around this guy. Do you know what I mean? I just feel like people might be that way around him. Because he's so commanding. Like. His presence is just. Otherworldly. Um, The prison setting. Is always fun. I don't know why. Just. Movies that are in prisons, based in prisons, around prisons, it's just like, I don't know, it's so interesting. The, just to think about the psychology of inmates, the guards, everybody who's involved in running these things, because it's such an interesting dynamic, you know what I mean? People dealing with feelings of like hopelessness, thinking they have no future, uh, stuck in this place, you know, not being able to do anything, having your freedom stripped from you. It's just like, it's always interesting to think about how these people are feeling inside, do you know what I mean? At least for me anyway. Um... Another thing, I didn't know this movie was supernatural, that it had like fantasy themes. What the heck? That surprised me. Like, I honestly thought from 
what I've heard, it was about a man who was doing time for a crime he didn't do. I think that's what the vibes I was getting before I watched this movie were. And instead we have Michael Clark Duncan being a bloody miracle of God who can heal people. That took a turn I did not see. That was that was pretty interesting. I did not see that coming. Um one last thing, a little critique of mine. I think the runtime was a little too long. Over three hours, it's like it's not Lord of the Rings, do you know what I mean? Like I understand, you know, you just need to build exposition, you need to do world building. I get that. I get that. You gotta make sure that you care about these characters so that by the time, you know, they die or something happens to them, you really care about it. But at the same time, it's like I don't know if this movie needed to be three hours long. I don't know if it needed to be three hours long. Don't kill me. It's just the way I feel. Anyway, score, 8.5 out of 10. I think it's a fair score. It was a really good movie. I'm happy I watched it. I don't know if it's one of those movies I could rewatch though, if you know what I mean. I think a movie like Forrest Gump has a lot of rewatchability compared to a movie maybe like The Green Mile. Just my opinion. Don't hate me. Don't crucify me. It's just the way I'm feeling. But um, yeah. I think we might do Scarface next week. I was looking at the list. I'm pretty keen for Scarface. It's been on the list for some time. I really want to watch it. So I think that might be next week's video. But until we see it, don't believe it. Anyway, until next time, thank you all for the support. Thanks for, thank you for watching these movies. Let me taking the time out of your day to spend some time with me on these epic movie nights we have together. Love it. Love you. Thanks for the support as always. Until the next one, I'll see you. Love you. Take care. Stay safe. Bye.